think my relationship with the ocean started with my fascination with water. My family is from Iran, so my people come from the desert. When I was 11 or 12 years old, we went to the Virgin Islands and I saw a healthy coral reef for the first time and I think I lost my mind. It changed me forever. I'm Dr. Shreen Rahimi. I'm a marine anthropologist, underwater filmmaker, and National Geographic explorer. I'm featured as a contributor for National Geographic Shark Fest. For my work, I focus on coral reefs, how they're adapting to a quickly changing marine ecosystem. A lot of sharks are under grave threats. Their habitats are being destroyed, their food sources are being taken away by fishing, and so shark tagging is this tool that scientists have where they can gather all of this data about these sharks so that they can better protect them. Three months ago, while I was on a shoot filming shark tagging off the shores of Florida, one of the sharks that we were tagging was released off the hook and it swam at me and bit me right here in the chest. While it's very statistically unlikely, the vast majority of shark bites are very minor. I often will team up with other scientists that have more expertise than me when I'm trying to tell a specific story. One of those people is Dr. Katherine McDonald. She's an incredible shark scientist doing really exciting and very thoughtful and, and caring work with sharks off of the shores of Miami. I'm Dr. Katherine McDonald. I'm the director of field school and I'm a lecturer at the Rosenseal School of Marine and Atmospheric Science at the University of Miami. And I study juvenile and mesopredatory sharks. And what that means is that I study smaller bodied sharks that live their lives not only out there looking for food, um, but also trying to make sure that they don't get eaten. We're collecting data about who's giving birth, when, how big are the babies, and also questions like, how's the bay doing right now? What's present in the waters you know, at this time of year in these temperatures? And uh, starting to collect a more holistic picture of the ecosystem here. Looks like we got a shark on the line. It's so pretty. I know, it's beautiful. When I got bitten, I told myself that I didn't want to work uh, with shark tagging again because it was not the best experience. But after seeing the way that you do your work, I knew that I had to get out there again. Well done. Nice. 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 Do it again. It was so inspiring to be working side by side with Catherine, doing our best to help these sharks live and thrive in their habitat. For more, check out Shark Fest on National Geographic.